What is up, mad beautiful world? Yeah, I know. You don't normally see my handsome face that often on YouTube. Uh, what am I talking about? Um, but I decided to make this a little more personal. So if you guys are not caught up, yes, I was hacked. And then my channel got terminated. And I got it back because miracles happen. <laughs> um, and those who were caught up, I just want to briefly thank you um, for being really supportive. You guys are the ones who notified me about what was happening to my channel in the first place. And you guys, uh, you, my family, and my friends have kept me calm in this situation. And you see, the channel came back, you know, after worrying so much for for the past few days. So let's get into the wacky ass story. So the timing couldn't be worse. I was out when this was happening in the, during the evening. And the only time I found out was through Instagram when people were DMing me about uh, what was happening to my channel saying, Hey, um, so Hattie, this, this is weird and I think you may have been hacked because the channel title changed, the banner changed, the profile picture changed, all the videos are deleted, seem deleted, and now there's this weird ass live stream of a cryptocurrency scam. <clears throat> I had no words to describe how I felt during that time. I was stunned and I was shocked and I was so confused, I was frustrated. It was a wild night for me and I also found out that all of my Google accounts was logged out of my phone and then when I logged into my computer, thank god I still had uh, access to the channel, it was not logged out for some reason. I go to my YouTube uh, studio and try to change back everything, but then the hacker would change everything back and put the live stream back on. Thankfully, all of the videos that I thought were deleted, um, they were just uh, they were privated instead. That made the situation a little less stress, a little less stressful, but still <laughs> still panicky nonetheless. And then they gave me. Um, an email they emailed me through my own gmail and decided hey um don't worry too much all we want to do is uh, uh use your account to stream uh a cryptocurrency scam and we will totally uh, like give you the channel back and give you the money like as if i gave two shits about the money all i cared about was my effort and my career and all the following the community that i built on youtube was gonna get taken away by these freaking uh weirdos that were trying to negotiate me with the uh, with money and they just piggybacked off my subscribers and viewership and obviously knew no one kn knew what was happening everyone was genuinely confused whoever subscribed to me they get a weird notification of of a separate channel not knowing it was mine i just happened to be hacked and then after a bit of a uh, struggling to get the my google accounts back everything was set i managed to change my password i secured my google accounts a ton and then i was putting everything back up on my channel and me and my followers, my friends and family, we were all stress-free for a while. Everything was supposed to be back to normal. Then, the time I was about to go to bed, it was 1 a.m. Someone told me that they couldn't find my channel anymore. And I was like, what do you mean? And if I searched if that happens... Your channel could possibly be terminated or suspended. And that was it for me. I stayed up all night 
during that time to figure out what to do but it was 4 a.m. and I was like I have stressed out so much enough I need to sleep it off and find a solution tomorrow I was feeling so dead inside that you know but luckily during that next morning my mom the calmed me down and said that you know hopefully YouTube doesn't you know turn turn the other cheek and not do something about this so if you discuss your situation on Twitter the t- team YouTube the f- official account will respond to you which it was something it made me feel a little less stressed that they they were so responsive for the past few days and you know trying to help me with my situation knowing that getting your account terminated beyond reason and also at the time I thought I received no email of why I was terminated that's the one that made me so frustrated I've heard the horror stories of channels being terminate terminated beyond all reason and without warning and most people get their accounts back some people don't it's very wish it's like it's a flip of a it's a flip of a coin but they were so responsive and they said they will they they messaged me and they said they'll send in the proper team to further review um, my situation and while they were doing that I decided to search and search in my gmail like I there must be something that I'm missing and lo and behold I found the fucking email of my channel being terminated in the trash I don't know how it got there I think it's something that happens if your if your channel gets terminated everything goes in your uh, junk mail or whatever but anyway yeah there was an email saying that my channel was terminated because I violated policies which I didn't recall doing and then my suspicions and a lot of people's suspicions were uh, correct that it said why I was terminated and a video was removed and it was the stupid live stream that the hacker hosted so basically I was my channel was terminated for something that I didn't even do I was fortunate enough to say that YouTube was very responsive of this and they were I, they were genuinely apologetic for making such an error because can you imagine fucking up (laughs) that badly and this isn't you know the first time they fucked up and the cryptocurrency scam the fact that hackers can steal people's channels big and small is very common and it has happened to a lot of people and it's still something that youtube you know has to get their shit together in and i understand that they have to handle billions and billions and billions of users every day who could be using YouTube, you know, for the wrong intentions and making gross content. But there has to be a better way to, you know, to give people at least a warning of warning before getting their before getting their channel completely terminated unless it's like a really really severe case. I don't think a channel should be just immediately terminated without hearing the hearing the creator's side of the story of why so that they can fix the solution immediately so that no termination needs to happen you know what I mean but anyway they sent me a form that I need to send proof of why I was hacked all the screenshots that you guys um, that you guys sent to me on Twitter and Instagram they were super super helpful and I even screenshot the gmail conversation the gmail conversation I had with the hacker of how they tried to negotiate with me um, and I don't think it was necessary to show this either but extra proof of why I was hacked of why and how I was hacked is because of a Trojan malware Trojan Trojan slash malware virus that was seeping in my computer it may have came from a shady a shady website that I was not uh, aware of because I don't clean my computer enough like a fucking idiot but 
Anyway, my uncle helped me download a Malwarebytes uh, software during the day I was hacked so we could uh, find the malware and it was there. They have scan reports so I used it as proof to show that there was indeed a virus in my computer. So I gave that to the YouTube team as well so they can, you know, respond faster and quicker if you give them like um, solid proof that you may have uh, been hacked. It also helps to tell them what content you create so it would be so uh, so it mismatches from what the hacker is doing and what I actually create as a uh, content and I was feeling hopeful thankfully and lo and behold hours later my channel came back and it was a cel celebratory day for my community through all my socials everyone was so happy my friends were happy my family was happy i would call it such a shitty thing that happened to me but it was it was still quite quite the experience because i learned a lot um i learned a lot from it make sure your channel is uh and your google account is always secured the two-factor verification is super super important y you can only access your account with a verification code that is sent through your sent through your phone or backup codes that only you know so be sure to secure your accounts at all times and change your password like, well you know what that's <laughs> that's common courtesy and it also helps to download like a good computer scanner cleaner to make sure you don't have any viruses that may have caused your channel to be hacked and screenshots are super helpful in case these things happen in case when if your followers or your subscribers anyone you know is informing you about an issue and they they give you screenshots save that as proof because proof of how you're hacked and why you were hacked for something that you didn't even do it will help you in your case if your account gets uh, terminated terminated and again, I want to say thank you to YouTube for being really responsive to this. It's because it's not just my situation. It's it's the fear that it could happen to other YouTubers as well, especially uh, s smaller, smaller accounts and smaller followings. I hope now that you know about what I had to go through, that you can learn a thing or two of how to prevent this uh from from happening but most importantly what i've learned is that having a community is like is so power is so powerful because no matter what happens to your channel or accounts your community will always back you up and they inform people about the situation as much as possible and it's teaching me to, you know, to not, you know, it's making me appreciate what I do a lot more because of this experience. And I know a lot of people heard that uh, I wanted to make a, a second channel or a backup channel in case I didn't get my and then in case I didn't get my YouTube channel back and I still want to do that because I've always wanted to do two channels and I think it's about time that the second channel will be all the original work all my original projects will be in one place which would be Be More Sincere, Project Life, The Kirkstone Brothers everything that I made originally and um, are voiced by my team I want it to all go there for this main channel um, I wanted uh, I wanted to slowly start adding something a little more personal personal opinions as a storyteller and things I learned about uh, as an artist on my journey and I hope you guys will like it and of course the animatics are not gonna go away in this main channel there will always be Dan uh, Danganronpa related stuff in it this is just something to add a little spice a little bit of me in it you know and everything original that you still want to follow will be on the second channel which i hope you will uh, hope you will support and anyway i think that's about it
I also think it's important to learn that um, you can't always uh, rely on YouTube as your one source of putting your content out there. There has to be several in case things go wrong. Which, by the way, I wanted to mention that I'll be rebuilding my website and it's about time I put the uh, videos in a website where people can see it in one, uh, in one place. Because I heard that I heard from a lot of people that uh, helps a lot to just have a website of my own where people can uh, go to instead of just going to YouTube and get an update from me because sometimes YouTube doesn't notify you so it's like <laughs> you know what let's have an extra place for my for my stuff and I'm trying to, so I'm trying my best to branch out to Twitch as well because I heard it's it's a, a little more user friendly and you know streams are fun are actually fun with you guys and i just i just have to keep my uh streaming uh consistent and such anyway i've been rambling on for a while and this video has gotten a bit <laughs> a bit long i'm sorry if my words are like all over the place because i have not talked like this um in a while without every time i put my art aside and just talk about me per se <laughs> it's still something i'm getting used to so um don't judge me too harsh <laughs> too harshly anyways i hope you guys take care um again thank you thank you so much for bringing my channel back for bringing my channel back and also keeping me calm and keeping me hopeful through these past few days um stay fabulous stay hydrated Mad Hattie, signing off for now. Bye!